Good morning, Liz. Good morning, Bill. I mean, I have learned more about bulls than I think I've ever wanted to learn in my entire life hanging out here, but it is pretty fun down at the Tacoma Dome. They're getting ready for the PBR that's happening tomorrow and Sunday. You know, earlier we talked about how the athletes, the riders themselves, stay safe. But we have to talk about the other athletes. So I've got Keyshawn Whitehorse here. Let's talk about the bulls and how you keep them safe because, you know, there are people out there that are like, oh my God, this is animal cruelty. What do you guys do to make sure that these animals are taken care of? I mean, just like Peter Creek Bow here. Look, he's right there behind you. He's ready to get. He's ready uh, to, for a pet. You know, a little scratch on the back and everything. Uh, you know, they're really well taken care of. Their trailers are safe. Uh, their tra some of the trailers actually have climate control. Some of the trailers, and then the feeding programs, uh, great. They have a high protein feed. It keeps them healthy and in shape. They work out every single day. Uh, and you know, as an athlete, they're athletes as well. But the thing about this sport is, it's both sides sports. So they got to be really taken care of in order to buck hard. And so we can get some big points on them. Uh, these uh, these bulls are worth a lot, a lot of money. Just like racehorses and such, uh, they're worth thousands and thousands of dollars. So they they get really taken care of, and uh, every single day they're loved on and everything. So they're great animals. Yeah, and between the segments that we've been doing all morning, like you've been here petting them, people have been coming up and petting them, and you're saying hi and you're talking to them the last segment I had on your spurs and I was very surprised to see that those spurs weren't pointy in fact they were very dull is that the right word yeah very dull uh, they're all the only thing is there is just kind of help you get a little grip you know there's no need to have them sharp that's gonna all that's gonna do is cut them up and it's just gonna not it's not gonna be very good for the, the right. for the bull the bull is there to help us the bull is there to be safe and for the stock contractor to pay that much money for them we're there to keep them safe as well as a rider and so you know all that's there for is just kind of help your feet kind of get a hold so you stay in the middle of the bull's back they're all uh, they've all been expect inspected by the judges and such so they're, they're uh, you know you get disqualified if your spurs are been tampered with or and such and you get a fine yeah. so as an athlete and a rider you don't want to get fined you don't want to be get disqualified right, right. so uh, you know all the spurs are all checked and they're ready to go and they're good and they're all approved by PBR now real quickly I have like Matt just a couple of seconds explain the belt buckle to me because this is like a big deal <laughs> uh, the belt buckle this one I wear it is just kind of memorabilia it's an older one I've won a few in between here this one and now but uh, it's what we all achieve and aspire for you know as riders it's a uh, something that that's a pinnacle of things whenever we win that means that we did good it's just like getting a trophy in the NBA for us that's what we wear we wear it around yeah. we uh, I enjoy it. We enjoy showing it off. Man, well, congratulations on that buckle. Hopefully, Keyshawn gets another one. You can check him out at the Tacoma Dome. PBR happening Saturday and Sunday. Bill and Liz, back on over to you. Yeah, and you know who has done what by the buckle that they're wearing. That's, that's uh, quite a feat. Yep. Ellen, thank you.